All right. So we got the car out here in the shop. Um, we're gonna take these tires off. We're gonna put the W. Did you show them? We got the other ones. Yep. Yeah, we just showed up yesterday. Okay. So we ordered a set of ten five Ws to go to a race we're going to. Uh, we'll show you that when we get there. But um, these are, these are gonna come off. We're gonna break these down. Put the other ones on. It's easier to do it on the lift than trying to do this at the track. So. Welcome back to the channel, VXM by Old Extreme Machines. Welcome to all the new subscribers. We're getting real close to the 500, halfway to that 1,000 point. So uh, don't forget to like and subscribe, share, the, leave some comments and stuff. At 500, we're going to do a giveaway. We'll figure out how we're going to um, do the shirt giveaway. We just ordered new shirts, so if you need shirts, hats, and... Um, we're doing pretty good with that. We are getting ready to go on a little trip. So we got the motorhome right there getting serviced. Got the car getting serviced. We're gonna do a oil change on the motorhome. So we're gonna drop the rear, get the tires off, get the tires all changed up, and then we're gonna put it on the other lift to service the valves, oil, all that good stuff. So we got the tires off, the rims and tires off. So this is what we're going to be putting on. These are 28 and a half, I mean, I'm sorry, 28 by 10 and a half W's, 15 W's. So you can see how much. Right? Not too bad. Okay. So, important thing to note when you're putting these on and when you're ordering them. Jags is pretty good about this with that, but when you order these, any slips for that matter, 88, 88, okay, so the rollout is the same, you want to be, Ricky Thompson tells you to be in at least an inch, but I mean that's a lot, so you can always get them the same, that's great, quarter inch or so, but when they send them to you like that, that's good. All right, so that's excellent, actually. I'm gonna finish mounting these back on here. Keep going with this. All right, so we got the wheels on, moved it over here to this other lift so it's flat on the ground. We just serviced oil change, check the tranny, check the rear, reset the anti-roll for that height. And that setup, we moved the four link. So I went on the computer, we got a program that'll uh, four link calculator so we went on there reset the four link for the small tires give it a little bit more anti-squat Josh is over here he's checking the air in the tires we're gonna reset the wheelie bars and then we're gonna do the uh, valve lash real quick make sure everything's tight underneath we did a nut and bolt check we're gonna nut and bolt check the inside and then the engine compartment make sure put it back together make sure nothing's falling off all right.
All right, so we got it all back together. Everything checks out good. Oil, everything, valves all set good. So ready to go as far as that goes. Take a little break, man, it's hot out here today. Boys went inside to have some lunch. So we're gonna wait till they come back out. Back it back out of here, get the nose back on it. And load it back in the trailer. All right, get getting it ready. Designated driver, get out. All right, we're gonna load this thing up. While it's still in the shade over here, and tomorrow we're gonna head out. Tell them where we are. We are at Galat Motorsports Park. We're gonna meet Turbo John down here tonight. Do some testing on the car with the small tire on it. All right. Hello. There's five of us. Thursday night test and tune. All set up here, ready to go. The boys are working on the junior track, so we're going to make a couple of hits with that. I'm going to make one pass with the car to get a data log so we can see how it works with the small tires. And then I'm going to let John look at the tune up real quick and see what we can do. small tires and the shock settings and air pressure that we had initially the car just blew off the tires at the hip. 
so we went back to the pitch. Met up with Turbo John. He looked at the tune-up. We changed the shock settings. No air pressure on the tire. Made an adjustment on the tune-up. And you'll see the results of that in the next video.